Hi guys, it's Unders just coming in with another really quick tip. Um, today we're just looking how we can normalize a bit of audio. I mean, say you are putting some stems out and you've got some really quiet sections. Normalizing that is going to make a better use of the dynamic range of a track. If you're bouncing out to 16-bit audio and it's a really quiet piece, you will lose some fidelity. So normalizing makes use of that full uh full dynamic range of the audio you're bouncing out to now there's a really easy way to do it we can select this region here there are some key commands to do it you can do alt command b but we'll go down to here we're going to go bounce and we're going to region in place cool and from here we've got normalize overload protection only which would stop it clipping effectively um, we're going to normalize on and we're going to bounce that to a new track we're going to leave the source alone brilliant it's giving me a new one below and you see it's a little bit louder this being the loudest portion here is now touching right on the edge if we zoom in you can see that has indeed been normalized and we can have a quick listen to it as well. Would you fight the chance to ignite your last D? Would you fight the chance to ignite your last defense? Fab, so we can hear that's a little bit louder. Now that is the nice and easy way to normalize audio. That will now be saved in the project file. So if you want, you could then export all the separate parts and build a sample library, or if their parts being sent over to somebody else. Good way to keep everything nice and level and so that they've got good quality samples. Thank you very much. Boom, don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>